Make sure to use code BANGLE at sign up on FanDuel for a $20 deposit bonus. And check out my second channel for other games coming up like Red Dead Redemption 2 and Call of Duty Black Ops 4. As well as my third channel with collaborations with some of your favorite YouTubers. Let's get into the video. What's going on guys? Bengal again here coming back at you with another video today back on New York Giants franchise. Today we play the Los Angeles Rams at home in the conference championship. This is the upgraded team 96 overall, 99 offense. 99 defense and we also add a new player into the 99 overall club on the team 99 overall derwin james we of course traded for him and i believe season two you'll have to let me know if i'm wrong but that also means that derwin james now gets the 99 overall equipment that he has rightfully earned i guess you could say uh after becoming a 99 overall so we're going to go ahead and add that on Vapor Club. I think it going right is probably going to be faster. Not that it matters. Uh, but yeah, I'll put those on. Show you guys what I'm done. And here it is. 99 Club Cleats, the Nike Alpha Menace Pros. And of course, the Vapor Jet 5 for the gloves. Looks really, really good. I think what would be awesome that I don't think EA would do, but what I think would be awesome is have like 99 club shooting sleeve or like everything like 99 club uh bands and all that because imagine how sick a gold shooting sleeve would look with that with the gloves and the uh and the cleats i don't know maybe that's just me the red looks really cool as is but uh i think i would really really enjoy seeing that gold shooting sleeve but all right bring on the rams we barely managed to escape the last game over the packers Hopefully, it's a little bit easier today against the Rams. We'll have to see. All right, Rams in search of a second Super Bowl. They got to go through us in order to even make the game. It's another snowy game here at MetLife. Can't wait for that. Fireworks going off, and we should see fireworks here today in a number of different ways. This is a very high-powered offense we're facing. We'll see how they play in-game. They've got a good defense. I saw John Johnson the third. They managed to retain LaMarcus Joyner, and we'll have White. Lightning Kyle. He's coming out here with no long sleeves. What a, what a baller. And the winner of this is going to take on either the Bills or the Browns in the Super Bowl. Interesting. First play is going to be a play action. Goff going to throw over the middle. Complete to Brandon Cooks. I was fooled to say the least and that left that route wide open my bad they're gonna lob it trying to get there with alex espinoza and we managed to force the incompletion good defense goff gonna throw out of bounds by a lot sideline again and it's intercepted morris dubose jumped the route Pass intended for Robert Woods, and he is a monster. That football is going the other way. I wish we could see a replay of that one. But wow. What a play by Morris DuBose to jump that route. Great stuff. Love to see it. Yeah, what a replay on that one. We're going to Saquon. Good spin move, and Saquon could be gone. He's got one man to beat down the sideline. John Johnson won't catch him. Touchdown. Saquon Barkley, 52 yards to the house, and just like that, he can make you pay so quickly. Unmatched speed in the entire NFL, especially from the running back position. What a running back, and what a run. We're going to take an early lead here after the turnover, courtesy of Morris DuBose, and then Saquon Barkley, a lot of wind here today. 17 miles per hour down into uh the west maybe i don't know what end part of the end zone we're in they're gonna run lawrence thomas says no balls loose i think he was probably down i don't know why lana collins is trying to get into it with roger saffold was he down i guess he wasn't we just missed an opportunity to force another, another turnover there great work from lawrence thomas to get into the backfield and now the Rams are faced with third and long. And now it's going to be third and even longer as Gerald Everett. I believe that was a false start on that left side. 
And indeed it was. We'll see how the Rams play this on third and 20. My guess is they're not going to try and convert. And uh, yeah, they, they don't even at all. They gain a couple back, I guess. But, uh, or eight. But it's... Nah, they were just trying to get better field positioning for that punt. And it is a boomer. Out of the back of the end zone, so it's a touchback. But wow, that wind is strong today. Barkley again. Breaks a tackle. Used a turbo a little bit too early there. We could have been looking at the end zone again. Third and four. I'm just going to run Barkley again. And why not? But we can just easily get the first with him. Another third down here. Good blocks. Barkley hit the hole, please. All right. You know, it's a first down. Marcus Peters wraps up. Something he doesn't do in real life. That's okay. Ooh, they're bringing that safety up. Let's flip that play. And try to find a hole. Aaron Donald just shed so quickly. John Johnson made the tackle, I know, but... Wow. I kind of forgot he's on the team, honestly. Like... We haven't even seen him so far today other than that play. Okay, so the Rams jerseys really blend in with the snow. <laughs> I did not see Marcus Peters on the sideline at all. Like at all. That's it's that's cheating. Basically, it might as well be, honestly. We're going to throw that back across the middle. Sterling Shepard has the ball ripped out by John Timu. Come on, man. Hold on. We're going to have to punt the ball back on fourth and eight. But you guys know me. I am the best punter on YouTube. And uh, inside the 20. Wow. Amazing. It's that win, dude. I haven't calculated for it yet. Next time. If there is one, you'll see. I am the best. Oh, that's no good. Todd Gurley picks up 10+. plus. Get there. Somebody tackled Todd Gurley. Thank you, Derwin. Second and seven. Gurley has some space. Thankfully, Morris Dubois got in there. Alex Espinosa from behind. And um, we stopped Todd Gurley before any real damage could happen. It's going to be third and four. And I think it's going to take us into the second quarter. And it will. Third and four. Sideline, almost. I meant outside. Todd Gurley seems to be their only offense. Gets the reception on third down, and they convert. Goff, with all the time in the world, throws wide open. I didn't see Morrissey, but am I blind, dude? That was another good contested catch. Second and nine. Outside handoff. Goodson gets juked. Alvin Simonson wraps up from behind, but Gurley picks up five. Third and five. Thomas, get after him. Goff throws. Goodson there, but the catch is made by Gerald Everett. The Rams convert again. Oh, Derwin James forces the ball loose. Recovered by Hassan Reddick. Derwin James came down and lowered the boom. And we force another turnover. The Rams were looking unstoppable on that. Third and ten. We're going to roll out with Kyle. Throw on the run. Not even in the neighborhood. Sweet. Oh, best punter on YouTube. I'm back. Are you guys ready for this? Boom. That's a winner. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Look at it fly. Oh, my God. No, it's out of the... Ah! It's a touchback. How much did I miss this by? No way. That's not best punter on YouTube behavior. Oh. Just missed. By like a foot. You hate to see it. To run, get there. Derwin James. Oh, I tried to force a fumble. All right, Ty Gurley's really fast. Ty Gurley's really fast. Good Lord. All right, he picked up 30. Okay. 
Second and six. Gurley has it. Lawrence Thomas brings him down. Good tackle. We got pressure in there with Roman Pugh, but Goff got rid of the ball quickly, and Robert Woods has another catch as the Rams convert again on third down. I want to see their conversion ratio because it, it's got to be really, really high. Goff, time, and time runs out. Roman Pugh, the Roman soldier, brings him down. Let's get it. It's a run on second and 22. Cam Jordan and Alex Espinoza stop Gurley. They are going to be out of field goal range based on the wind, I think. So third and 20. Would really like to stop them here from picking up even a single yard. Maybe that'll be a punt. Goff throws. Oh my God, Julius Manning tried to undercut the route. And Howard has the end zone. Okay. That is, uh, that is something else. Rams are going to tie things up at 7. We're having a good game so far. We need to get Saquon Barkley going again. Go, Barkley. Give me a spin. What are you doing? Where? Uh, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Where is Forrest Gump going? I know I just called a timeout by accident because I grabbed the controller, oddly. What What was that? I need to look at a replay. What just happened? Let's see Carlos Kershaw run this route. Are you guys ready? There he goes, about to turn up field. No. W where are you going? He just ran out of... What? <laughs> he just ran through the Rams sideline. And then uh, right through the stadium wall. He's gone. See you later, Carlos Kershaw. I don't know what that was at all. I, I, don't, I don't have anything to say. Thrown over the middle. Complete to Keenan Allen. First down and more. There we go. Good way to fight after contact. It's going to be a tough throw, but... Oh, Dell drops it. Tough start for Kyle Let A lot of throwaways, but still. We're going to throw that ball. And it's intercepted. It's just not. It's just not where it needed to be. Why can you not throw it in the wind? Uh, or, well, I, okay, I guess that answered my own question, but I hate that. <laughs> oh, intercepted by BJ Goodson! Defense wins championships! And we have a chance to score here. Seven seconds remain in the half. I don't know why they bothered to throw that. We're going to streak Odell. It looks like he's going to have one-on-one, -on -one, maybe safety help, but if we can have Evan Ingram... Draw the safety over. We might be good. We're going to go at Odell. It's intercepted by Marcus Peters. All right, let's just tackle and go to the half. Come on, man. We're getting no separation with the wide receivers. Bad. We do get to receive, though, to start the second half, but absolutely no separation. And it's a turnover fest in this game thus far. Should have just taken the points, probably. Another forced throw away because they send a blitz. Nobody gets open, and Kyle Laletta's numbers are horrific right now. It's open. Keenan Allen, thank you. First down. That was a like kind of a curl and go, but we had to throw that when we had it. Oh, Evan Ingram breaks a tackle, unfortunately out of bounds, before we can really get anything going. There we go, good block, Odell. Let's juke back inside. The juke never works. I gotta spin, man. I just gotta spin. Saquon having a great game, though. And Kershaw gets ankle tackled. He is a waste of space. Saquon Barkley drops the ball. No one is doing me any favors today. 
with holding on to the passes. And uh, if you don't catch the passes, we're not going to be able to move the ball when, when it's third and 11. I'm not going to run the ball in this situation. Odell. That's an under pressure throw. Yeah, Kyle's about to find the bench in a hot minute. How, how long is this field goal? Clearly, we're out of range. 55? Yeah, we're never going to be able to hit that in the win. Um, best punter on YouTube is coming back out. Let's pin him deep. Here we go. Neufeld. Uh, and that, that'll do it. That's a good punt. Pinning him on the five. I'll take it. Let's in with Espinoza, and Derwin James can't wrap up. Another third down conversion. Oh, Gurley has space. Gurley has a lot of space. Good thing he ran right back into uh, everyone on my team. I don't know why he did that. Get to the outside. Just wrap up. Sidney Jones, good tackle. Get pressure, somebody, please. Unfortunately not. And the Rams are really starting to get it going here. We got to put something together on offense because I don't know how long we're going to be able to keep the Rams out of the end zone for the rest of this game. Get pressure, please. Play action. Lawrence Thomas trying to get there. It's wide open over the middle. And the Rams are really starting to pick up the pace here. Get there. Somebody. Dalvin Tomlinson can't. Sims is wide open. And the Rams pick up another 20-yard gain. Run up the middle. And it looks like Gurley has the end zone. They're going to take a lead. You hate to see that. 14-7 in favor of the Rams. We have a minute here left in the third quarter. We got to start getting the ball going, moving down the field on offense. Like we're just we're just not doing it right now. What? Oh my God! Now I'm intercepted by John Timu. How is that even covered? What do you mean? I have to go in a replay. I have to, because I have Odell on a curl over the middle. That much we know has not changed. You got like you got to be kidding me with this game, and I know people don't like to hear me sit here and complain. What is this? Open receiver, hands out, and he just doesn't extend for the football, and it gets intercepted. It's just pure agony. Pure agony when I when I load this up, I. I cannot stand this game sometimes. This is one of those times. Going over the middle. How, how come that is an interception for me? If that last one's an interception. Come on, man. They're going downfield. And Sidney Jones got cooked. No pun intended. I didn't even know it was Brennan Cooks. I didn't see the number 12, but yeah. Haha. -ha. We're having a great time. And we enter the fourth quarter. Down by seven with the Rams threatening to put up another seven. We got to stop them from making it 21-7. We cannot make this a two-touchdown game. Get to the outside. Can you run, Espinoza? I don't know what this, like, this thing is where you're standing up straight and, like, power walking. Get to the sideline. Make the tackle, please. Do me a favor. Throw at me. Throw at me. Throw at me. Throw at me. Somebody get to Goff. Come on. Third and goal. I dare you to run it. Short. Short. Thank you. Good defense. Rams should kick a field goal here. I almost wish they would go for it because just no way they get in with this goal line defense. We're going to go down 17-7. About eight and a half minutes to play when we get the football back. They're going to fake it? Yeah, I wish you would. Idiots! Idiots!
IDIOTS! What a bunch of morons. Now we have a chance to go down the field, tie the football game. It's going to be on Saquon Barkley. We haven't really been able to get him going here in the second half. Don't worry, though. We got the momentum. We going to score. And the Browns have beat the Buffalo Bills and are going to the Super Bowl. How, Dude, Trent Brown is the most useless player on the entire planet. You have one guy to block, and he runs right past him. And it's third and eight. And we need a score. It's fantastic. We're going to throw that. Keenan Allen, first down. And I get sacked by Aaron Donald. There he is. Yeah, I mean, it's getting tough to throw the football when... And maybe I'm missing him, but... I don't see a receiver getting any separation at all. Throw inside to Odell. Thank you. Go, Kyle. Go, Kyle. Dive! He's going to be short. It's going to be fourth and inches or fourth and one. And uh, we're going to go for it. You don't draft a running back number two overall not to go for it on fourth and short. Fourth and one. Hand off. Barkley. He's just too fast. First down. Odell open over the middle. We have room to work with. Down the sideline. Spinning back. Odell Beckham Jr. is gone. Touchdown. The game is tied. There we go, baby. 63 yards to the house. And the yards after the catch is real. Odell turning on the burners. We're going to be tied at 14 with just under five minutes to play. Let's not shank the extra point. Would probably be good. We don't. 14-14. Time for the defense to step up. And Goff just going to toss it away. They're going to maybe say the intended receiver was Deion Sims. Pressure. Looks like it got in there. I saw Jared Goff getting off the ground. But it is going to be second and ten. Just over four and a half minutes to play. We got this. To delay, someone wrap up Gurley. Julius Manning, thank you. The Rams are going to lose one. It's third and 11. They've converted all day on third down. Third and long, third and short, third and medium. It hasn't mattered one bit. I'm not sure if we stopped them even once. On this down, all that changes. The defense is going to clutch up. They're going short. Big tackle. And the Rams should punt. Fourth and seven from their own 28. Let's just make sure they're not faking it. They're not. Hecker booms it. And that one is going to be uh, down at the 25. Three and a half minutes now for this giant offense. Kyle Aletta has been a lot better. That big play to Odell helps out his numbers significantly. Wide open. Evan Ingram. There we go. That's one of the worst spins I've ever seen. Come on. Oh, come on. Take one. Okay. Are they blitzing heavy here? Oh, we have Carlos Kershaw. That's unfortunate. We're going to keep the kind of this drag concept. See if Evan Ingram works open. It looks like he does. We're going to throw that. There we go. Too fast for LaMarcus Joyner. He couldn't catch up. And that should take us to the two-minute warning. Two minutes to play. We got the football. We're entering field goal range. Hell, we might even be able to hit it out here with the wind. But Saquon, going to make sure we don't need that. There's a flag. This one's coming back. Ooh, it's actually a face mask. I thought that would have been a holding. I didn't see the face mask. Usually, I, I catch the animation, but I didn't that time. And we are now inside the 30. Chris Spielman's red zone, which isn't one. I don't know if... I think I've told that story on the channel before. As Saquon Barkley rips off a nice chunk there. Where he's like, yeah, I know the world considers a red zone inside the 20. But I think it's inside the 30. And everyone... Huh? You say, so the world is in agreement that the red zone is inside the 20. But you're like, no, it's inside the 30? Okay. 
There we go, Carlos Kershaw. Not really a spinner. We got a minute and a half to play. We might be essentially playing for the field goal here. Trying to walk it off. Just don't fumble with Barkley. Los Angeles going to call timeout number one. And he can't run out Aaron Donald. I tried to speed burst out to the outside because we had more than enough space. And Saquon just never started running. It's timeout number two gone. Third and ten. I am running it. We're going to spin back. That's okay. Timeout number three gone. I'm planning to get rid of those timeouts and take the points. Not trying to turn over the ball by some bull. Field goal is up and good. With 40 seconds to play here at MetLife Stadium, we're going to take the lead 17-14 as Aldrich Rosas drills it. The Rams got to go all the way down the field in the wind and at least kick a field goal to force overtime. Three wide receivers to the left. Everett. Slot right. He's going to go ahead and pick up that one. Gain of seven, maybe. This forward progress is stopped. Good work from the defense to keep him up in the air. Honestly. And the Rams will spike it. 24 seconds remain. Third and three. I'm down to give them stuff short. That's more than okay. But Todd Gurley spins me out. With 15 seconds now, the Rams are approaching midfield. They're going to have to spike it really quickly. We're going to get everyone back just in case they decide to bomb it deep. And they're taking their sweet time to spike it. Six seconds to play. They might have one shot at the end zone. Just get deep. Get deep on second and ten. They're going to lob it up. And that is, oh wow, they hit a receiver that got opened on the tip. I would have freaked out like you guys have no idea. One second remaining. Goff has time and it runs out. The game ends in a sack. I think that was Kent Raymond that applied the pressure and brought down the quarterback. We don't even have to stress about a deep throw to the end zone. We've been beat by that before. McVay can't believe it. But the New York Giants are headed back to the Super Bowl. This game was a nail biter and honestly wasn't particularly fun to play. It was BS after BS after BS. I was having open receivers and I couldn't hit them because of the, the snow. And then when I did have the receivers that actually got open and the throw was there, they dropped the ball. Otherwise, they wouldn't get open. It was a nightmare. Saquon Barkley had a fantastic game, but we were in a position where we had to throw at some points there. Odell, two catches, 79 yards, and a touchdown was really the game-breaking moment for us. And then good defense overall. Sack for Kent Raymond at the end of the game was huge. Roman Pugh had one. Interceptions were flying today. Three for the Rams. How many of these were legit? Probably two. Probably two. Morris DuBose, BJ Goodson with interceptions. Uh, Force fumbles for Derwin James and Lawrence Thomas. Recoveries for Hassan Reddick. And no defensive touchdowns. But that's going to do it for me, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I will see you in the Super Bowl where we take on the Cleveland Browns. Take it easy.